All right, y'all. We got a video right here for y'all, man. Season nine of the next chapter, episode one. We got Team Diesel going up against Team Kale, tag team one on one. Apparently, it's Diesel and Corey Sanders versus Cam and Scar. Cam and Scar was a, a part of the first tag team one v one, which happened to be something that Frigga brought to the community. I'm gonna give my prediction right now. Based off this, I got Cam and Scar. I already said that I think Cam's team possibly will win the whole thing. And based off who Diesel and them got, Corey Sanders is the one to watch out for. Like, I've said this before, he had a game um, on Ball's life. But other than that, I don't know how many showings he's had. So, you really don't know what to expect from him. You just know he can really hoop. Diesel, you, you've been seeing Diesel, so you kind of got an idea. Cam and Scar, you know what they bring to the table. Corey Sanders is the one to be on the lookout for. Yeah, man, I don't want to waste too much time. If not subscribe, one subscribe. Please the notification bell, like the video, to the channel. Yeah. Let's get it. Welcome back to the next chapter. My name is Devontae Friga. I'm here with Scotty Weaver. We've got Team Cam versus Team Dizo. It's been built up for a couple of days. Scotty, what do you have to say? This is Battle of Family. Dizo, Cam, and Scar, who's on Cam's team, are a part of Friga fam. This is a battle of the fam. Let's see what happens, man. Corey, Corey Sanders is just, he's the X Factor, bro. I haven't seen I haven't seen footage of Corey Sanders since he was at Rutgers. Good take. Ah, got to throw it a little higher, a little higher. Game to thirty. Man, okay, so here we are. We finally get to see Dizo versus Cam, like we're talking. About. Dizo starts off. Dizo coming off of a an amazing season. Didn't lose one game that he was a part of. Dizo on the bench. DC. Talk to me, man. What, what do you what do you guys have? You guys have some strategies right now. How's the game going already? It's looking good. I like that shot. Hmm. I think he would have made. I think he possibly would have made it if he would have attacked the glass. Hmm. Corey, one v one setting. But what do you feel about you know being in the one v one with Dizo here? What do you like? I like it. It's nice. Uh, like this is the first time I did a tag team. I've been watching it, so I've been. Trying, oh, you know, that's I've been dead, dead, dead. He got. Sure. What are you looking to do when you get out there? Anything you're focusing on? Uh, just play my game. I got a little bit of all around game, so I just want to peep and see what I can do on the offensive side. I'm be honest, bro. If I'm guarding Dizo, I'm up. Cause thing with Dizo is Dizo's handle is not the greatest. Me personally, I go for steals a lot. Like I'm reaching. You know what I'm saying? And I'm usually good on getting a steal. <laughs> I'm playing up on Dizo. Now, Dizo can shock you to where you play up and he still go get a bucket, whether it's from a step back or he just drive aggressive on you. Dizo, he can pull he, he can pull some tricks out of the bag. But I just think that's the smartest thing to do. You can force him left, right, straight up, whatever. But just make sure you are up on him. Make him have to dribble while you're dead in his face. You give him a little space like that. He may just do one dribble and shoot, or he may just throw some jabs, pull up. I'm not giving him space. I'm up. Like, you know what I'm saying? I think that's the smartest the smartest thing to do EJ, against Dizo. EJ, what are you thinking about the game so far? Game, talk to me. Oh, yeah, I love it. Um, it's really hard to put anybody above Dizo in a one-on-one -on -one just because he's so physical and play with so much energy. Shot. But I like Dizo over Cam. To the midi. Oh, what a tough Tate. Tate. And I ain't gonna lie, when it comes to Cam, tough part about Cam is this. He's he's pretty good. He's pretty good at going left or right. Become a member, you and a guest are automatically entered in to be flown out to watch. Cam is pretty good at going left to right. Me personally though, I'm a gamble and make him go right. And he's right-handed. The reason I'm making go right is because I feel like he does, I like the the gold, the little hezzy. Like I feel like a good amount of his moves and the best moves come from the left hand. So I don't, I don't even want to, I don't want to send him that way. And he gets to those moves. I prefer to send him right where he's probably not going to do. Some of those moves, I'm not saying all of them, but some of those moves he might not do going right. Based off what I've gathered and seen from watching Cam, 
um, for for a while now. But that's just me. All right, y'all can see the score is three to four right now. Cam is up by one. Game goes to thirty. And this is tag team, so both of them have one person that can sub in. They can just keep alternating in and out between each other. They hit that. That's. Dizzo would make that shot though. Wouldn't make that as I'm talking like. Like I told y'all, Dizzo got some tri got some tricks out out the bag that he can get to, bro. Like he he surprise you at times. Good tape, good tape, bro. I've only had praise for Dizzo. You can watch the live streams, you can watch the videos. I've only ever said Dizzo has been improving in my eyes. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I rock with Dizzo. Uh oh. Corey in. Right here. Hold on, this is my first time watching Corey Sanders play since he was at Rutgers, man. This is my first time watching him play. Like I told y'all last stream, I got introduced to Corey Sanders by Rod. That was one of Rod's favorite dudes in high school. So yeah, let me let me, let me sit up a little bit for this one. You guys, let, let me sit up a little bit. Let's see what Corey finna get to. See it. Cam, my God, oh. I rock with Cam. Cam, one of my favorite in the community right now, bro. Oh. Damn. Oh, he missed. Cam just the he shit just out missed. <laughs> Scars checks in. Make some noise. Scar. Defense and offense, boy. That man, Scar, is different, bro. Bank. It's open. Shot. I'm I'm gonna like this because I know score I know Damn, Corey got so offense now, in him. How you feeling about the pace of the game? How you feeling about oh. how you're playing? And all I know Corey got offense, but Scar, I'm not making no Scar, idea. in my opinion, is, is arguably oh, the team best team defender team. out of everybody in there. Um, so I want to see how how that matchup is, and Scar also got offense. That's the thing about Scar. Like I said, I don't know how Corey's defense is. We're going to see it now, though. Dizzo is changing his shoes right now. Dizzo, you just subbed out. Talk to me about how the game's going right now. How you feel? You know, it's 9-4. It's going the way it's supposed to go. Mm. We just got to keep the same thing going. He got to stop scoring. What are you expecting from uh, Corey here? Mm. He's about to go crazy. Got this is an amazing episode one to this season. Ah, that, that, was, a, that was a bumpy ride. Going, what? going to the ground. Going through your mind right now, seeing this format and everything, making you excited to play it all. Hell yeah! I, you know, one on one is very, very, very New York. Oh, good shot. The style from all ah. Be here with right now. I love it. What team are you on? Um, I'm not on none of these teams. <laughs> Corey game. I play against Corey. I'm just, a, I'm just yeah, a viewer. So is Scar. You take. You take. You take. You take. That's very tough. I ain't gonna lie. That was simple and tough. Yep. You ain't got to always do too much. I preach that all the time, bro. You can get to it without doing extra. Whether it's dribble moves or extra dribbles. Like, you ain't got to do too much, bro. Just get to it. Did he hit it? I think he... Dead ball. Good D. Yeah, hit it. One of these days, I might be out there with them. We'll just have to see what the future holds. Energy. Everything. I love it. I love it. Uh... I need Scar to get on the board. Oh my gosh. Scar is so nice, bro. Ah. Think about how, uh, but let me see some real quick though. Let it. me see some. Let me let me slow it down. I'm gonna see if I see it. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna let y'all know what I see if if I if I saw what I saw. Let's see it. I need Scar to get on the board. Oh my So whenever I see it, it's it's like that. So yeah. Uh, hit a, what, easy Shot. Oh, he thought he got hit. Hey, good patience. Patience. Nice bucket. Calm. Patience. Huh. Glass. Ah! See what Corey talking about. Hands, hands, man. These old hands, be active, man. He, oh, good shot. Let's get this shit going, y'all. Good shot. These are in there. Family affairs. First Diesel and Cam. Now Diesel and Scar. See it. Hmm. The step back. A step back. Mm. 
Mmm. Shot. Half time. How to guard Scar, in my opinion. Um, I'm gonna be honest. Garden Scar is a little different from Cam and Dizo. Scar is one of the most skilled basketball players within the realm of the YouTube content creating um, basketball space. Scar is one of the most skilled. Like the tricks that Scar has and able to do in both hands is ridiculous. So I'm be honest, you just gotta play with your heart out. You know what I'm saying? Play your heart out. You can throw different things at them to see which one works and try and stick with it. I don't know. Maybe I haven't looked into it deep enough watched him closely enough to be able to pick at something if anything i would just say for some left if anything if not for some left then just play straight up honestly or you can get get up on him get up make him work to get to that that tough stuff get up you know what i'm saying one of those three all right, here all right. We go right out of half time. second half man half time, 15 to 11 team like cam to, game uh, to 30. to watch the first game over here. Um, it's all right, you know. Uh, I like the format. There's only one thing I really don't rap with. It's the, it's the reaching, you know what I'm saying? Damn, that's Star hitting that shot. Star is hidden. Yeah, like, somebody reaches, hit your arm, and the ball uh, goes. He got to get up. Now, Dizo got to play up closer now. Like, he's hitting. Play closer. You know, played on Freakers channel, so let's get lit. Well, I was about, about to end this video. Oh, travel, travel. Watch the feet. First foot he moved was the right. I meant the left. Once you move a foot and you haven't dribbled the ball, you only can move that one foot. First foot he moved was the left. Left. Look at the right foot. Lift it. Moved it. Travels. He moved up. Like, oh my gosh. Ah. Left. Yeah, get up. You got to get up on Scar now. Get up. Get up. You got to stay up. Oh, good move. But Scar had made a run to kind of take him. Dizo got to play up. You know, obviously Scar made Don't give him space. It's kind of hard to hard to sub in and out then. Um, but how are you feeling right now? You feeling like and you're going soon? Uh, yeah. yeah, definitely just a game of runs. Just a lot of this. Linked into him. Hood. Thanks. But, hey, there we go. Take. Like I said, with Dizo, I think you just play him. Just play him. Get, get, you got to get up on Dizo too because you made a little bit of a make him have to dribble head, and don't let him pass you. You know what kill, I'm saying? Kill, kill, I don't kill, think you kill, force Dizo left or right. Make him have to get past you while you just jumper. straight up on him. him straight up on him. Yeah, I'm showing him something else. I'm showing him a new and improved scar. Let's get it. Dizo can run for some shots. That's why I say you can't. Don't give him space. He can run for some shots, bro. He's done it. Hey, K. Come on, Cam. Corey in there. Come on, Cam. Corey and Cam, let's see it, man. Well, Sanders just checked in. We're seeing Cam versus Corey right now. Good def that was, see that was good defense. Right he missed that shot on his own because Corey didn't even contest it. He's, he got to knock that down. But good defense for Corey staying with him. Hey, get into him. And one. Take. Nice lay. That wasn't a foul. I just, you know. Basketball players know you say and one just because. Bo. First time here in the next chapter. Good well, shot. We'll see energy uh, like in the gym ooh, for the people that short. have never been live and in person. It's great, man. It's great to be in an environment where it's just about everyone's about hooping, but also there's an inter entertainment and energy. Hey, oh boy, I thought Car Corey was taking crazy. that. We'll see. You know, when I get in there, it's gonna turn up. It's good take, though. Good take by Cam. Mmm, shot. The shot. I've said this many times. So do not let Cam get so that Cam shot going. Off. If Cam gets that three ball going, game, it gets tough. Goes it gets goes tough. Oh, I thought I thought he was activated. Game, maybe not. He may he may be warming up still a little bit. Oh, good shot. Ah. That's that, that, yep. This is really great. Smiling so hard for all the people that can't see Tricky right now. We're talking ear to ear. <laughs> I love basketball, so this is amazing. My first mm, time. shot. And I'm just enjoying the energy. energy. Corey got to get it going, man. Very, very Once you get it going, Corey, the, the score could change very quickly. You know, these games are going to 30, so. Mm. Good take. Ah, yeah, foul. Cam didn't like that call. The foul, let's see. 
I wouldn't call it. I wouldn't. You didn't like that call. Ah! Damn. Yep, Dizo in. Alright, Dizo. Let's see if you can slow down Team Cam for the time being. Yeah, I about to say, you gotta call that one if you call it the core one. But that that one you could actually say is a foul because he got hit while he was in air. Hmm. Good move. He he changed he changed speeds so quick. Corey, you just checked uh, out. How you feeling? What's going through your head? I'm good. 419. Game's not over. Yeah, See it. Time. Need that. The shot. Hmm. Big shot. Ah. 1v1s. If you guys are here in the premiere, you guys have a 2v2 next game. Um, so what's going through your head in this very moment? I know you're mid-game, but... Come on. Get this oh. right here. I wouldn't have been surprised if he made that. He done made it already like two, three times. On that side of the court. Going that way. Yeah, I about to say, Dizo flick. Let's see. Did he touch him? Oh, yeah, he, he hit the elbow. He hit the elbow. Ref obviously didn't see it if he didn't call it. Guess thing about it. Hitting that elbow, it don't matter if they barely touch it. If they, if you get your elbow hit when you're shooting, bro, your shot is going to mess you up. Unless you just prone to it. Like, you train yourself to where it doesn't bother you. I remember the first time Martin did it to me. Like he barely did it. I was like, what the heck? <laughs> As I was shooting, I was confused. See it. The defense, better offense, good oh, shot. I got said, bro. Scar is his. He, he just a little different, bro. A little right different. Now, spam fire. Twenty six to twenty, man. Team Cam need three more. I meant four more. Oh my God, Scar! I'm be honest, bro. I'm be honest, man. Cam and Scar are two hoopers where they gotta like build into their shot you know what i'm saying but scar came out the gate just on a on, on some different timing when it comes to the threes and he may just get ready to end it oh my god he may just get ready to end it got nothing to say he he could just stay in the game this shit over with he can stay in this game here scar 29 20. let's see it is that it So I'm dip. Davion Scarborough. Man. Game one of the series. That Do was a performance, this a boy. Series. This is a best of three series. We got three what they stats look like. Scar had 22 points. He only allowed eight. Cam had 10 points. Only allowed 12. Diesel had 11 points. Allowed 19. And the majority of them came from Scar, shoot. And Corey had nine and allowed 13. I'm gonna be honest, bro. Scar coming in in the beginning of the game, that is where it shifted. You know what I'm saying? Scar came in on another one and was he went straight to it. He got straight to it. He didn't waste no time. I enjoyed the game. The only thing that I would say I was expecting more was from Corey on the offensive side. I was expecting to see him do his thing, but Hey, bro, you know what I'm saying? You gotta, sometimes you gotta, you gotta just warm up into it. You know what I'm saying? Everybody, everybody don't always go crazy every game. If we able to see him play again in this series, then he may go off. We just have to wait and see. Based off what Diesel has shown last season, uh, season before that, I expect a little more. But yeah, man, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Give more videos, do give more videos to that too. I'm getting to SAPPP. And yeah, man, that's pretty much it. Let's just call it bull crap. We out. All right, that was a good game. That was a really good game.